and a small one, a strong nation, I, Yahweh, Hashem, Yahushai, will hasten it in his time. That's, that's the that's kingdom. Come on, right? Our children and our kingdom. You know, babies going to be, let's be, we're going to have sex in the kingdom and, and make or make righteous babies. Yep. And those babies are going to be who? Those wicked ass Israelites yep. coming back in the kingdom yep. from this side. Jay Z, yep. Drake, uh, uh, you, you name them. Yeah. Those, you know, uh, and Jake's out here, uh, uh, that's wicked being Gentiles. And I'm going to tell you something heavy too, brother. We're going to have wives of the other nations. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know. I know. Even the concubines. concubines. Yeah. You yeah. know what I mean? They're going to be treated right. Like so like, they're going to be treated right. All right, my thing is this. So when, um, when that thousand period up with Esau, I know they're gonna be destroyed. Is it gonna happen in like that, or like a like it's gonna happen in like a like a um, ratchet? Like well, uh, 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 Obadiah right. one and eighteen. Yep. It's gonna be what you would call a bonfire. A bonfire. Yeah, it's gonna be a it's gonna be a point in time yeah. where it's gonna be set up where they're gonna be all gathered mm -hmm. and they're gonna burn. Oh, wow. they're gonna burn. So like just that. like that, like that. <laughs> you know. And you know, uh, we speak in the spirit, of course, but we're as men we are. But, um, you know, a spirit can't be destroyed because all spirits come from the Father. So, you know, we believe what we'll see. We believe once the nation of Esau is destroyed, his spirit will come back through other nations. Nations. I, I, I kind of figured. I could see that, though. And so, because so, I do know Esau is a reincarnation of Cain. Yes. So he may come back looking like how he's supposed it's to. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. But he won't have the mark. Mark. Yeah. He won't have the mark yeah, okay. anymore. Uh, yes. Uh, see? see? Yeah. Which yeah. makes sense because yeah. in the kingdom, we're going to be set up to be as judges. Mm -hmm. But who's going to judge? Because he's the nation that are going off. Yep. Yeah. Because we can't judge our people because they're already going to have the law. So that so that, so that skin that skin texture won't be in the earth anymore. No, no unle unless they're unclean through leprosy. And then leprosy will still be in the kingdom. Yeah, yeah. And then we're going to judge them. You know, so the wilderness is going to be a booming business. Because if you have leprosy, you got to be separated. You see? So, but the heathens are going to be coming to us. They're going to be asking, you know, we're going to be the ones delegating everything. And each brother, you know, everyone's going to have their portion. You know, Yahweh Shai is going to divvy out like Solomon. Because, you know, Solomon's Yahweh Shai. Yeah. Yeah. So when Solomon was on the scene, he divvied out uh, uh, every, each, every his 12 men yeah. each got a Sabbath. Yeah. Yeah. So each one had a he he was in control of it that month mm -hmm. or that moon. Because Sabbath goes by the yeah. moon. Yeah. So he he had it that month. And this man. So we're all going to get our portions of the pie yeah. and then we're going to delegate to the nations according to the law. But with our intellect, yeah. we're going to be we're going to be running through the earth doing what we want according to righteousness. Divine wisdom, man. Yeah. We can't beat that. You know? yeah. you're, in, you're in the throne. Yeah. You know? yeah. 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 Which we got it now. That's what we're recording yeah, on. Yeah. That's what I want to get on the, um, the internet. Yeah. I'm like, okay, like, you know. Yep. Okay, yeah. Oh, we get it. Uh, Psalms 19. Yep. 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 Yeah. Psalms 19. Yep. Oh, Matthew 24. Matthew, Psalm went into. Yep. yep. How did, how, how is uh, the word being preached unto all nations? Oh, yes. Yeah. You know, not a jet. The YouTube. Because that's crazy. Because back in the day, my auntie talked about that to me in the 80s. She said it's going to get around through the computer. She's like, she talked to well our neck. It's going to go out throughout the world. And I ain't thought about to one of the brothers have brought it out. And I said, yeah, I said, oh, so that must be some truth to it. Because my aunt said that to me back in the 80s. Right. You know what I'm saying? She said it's going to do a neck. Do you know when, um, not to cut you off, brother. Yeah. Do you know when the first time the internet was used? What year? It's, it's links up with biblical prophecy. Okay, I'll ask you this. What were you going to say? I know it's like somewhere in the 80s. Well, even before that, I'll ask you this. Uh, when did when did uh, Esau, um, when did his demise fully commence? Like when did, what, what action did he do to lead to the Lord about to bring him down? What did he, he do? He went to the arms of the space. What year? Uh, 1969. And that's the same year they used the internet. Yeah, okay. So Ooh. it's very spiritual so, yeah. that, that that action, a part of, according to Obadiah, then I shall bring thee down. Yeah. In 1969 uh, was the same time Abba Bivens, are you familiar with Abba Bivens? Yeah, of course. Coming back as Elijah. Elijah, yeah. 1969, that was the same time that they first used the internet that we use now to push the truth to bring his end. Oh, wow. That's, I like that one. Listen, Al Bashan is the ultimate chess player. Wait. Esau's been done for a long time. It's just like uh, right it's now, it's being made manifest. Though. Festive, okay. you know? So it's like, all right, I'm going to allow you to so called lie to the world and say you went to the moon, but as I'm uh, granting that, I'm also going to throw profits. Mm. So it's like, I'll, I'll yeah. let you, but I'm, I got to also do this too. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, you got, hey, where's Esau get fine print from? The Most High. 
Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? The most high. It's like the sweet is knowing you're an Israelite, you're chosen, but the bitter is I put your ass to death if you're being wicked. wicked. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah. it's balance. It's balance. Yep. You know, but we deal with that. Esau he puts you in a contract, but if you don't pay the bill, I gotta shut you off. Yeah. I mean, but he, he does it wickedly, you know what I mean? But it's it's kind of in the same realm. Yeah, it's you know right, what I mean? Equal balance. Right. You got some, brother? Yeah, yeah you read it's the book of Romans 10. I'll start get to the point in verse 18. Romans 10 and verse 18. But I say, have they not heard? Yes, verily, their sound went into all the earth and their words unto the ends of the world. Yeah. Right. And that's going about, about the internet, really. Because, because how can, you know, uh, we get this uh, this glorious gospel push? You know, like, we can't go to, you know, uh, you know get a bottle and send it to, to, to someone. Yeah. You know, we got internet. Yeah. We got satellites, the feed horn. The, uh, right, what's that called? The uh, unicorn. The water. Unicorn. The unicorn. Yeah, the you satellite. The, the satellite. The, the reason why they call it a unicorn the because the on a satellite is that that's the feed the horn. Field, yeah. You see, and that's where the the feed comes in yeah. back and forth. Yep. Uh, I got one to nineteen. Yeah, yeah. All right. This is Psalms nineteen and uh, one. It says, "The heavens declare the glory of the Most High, and the firmament shew His handiwork." Day unto day uttereth speech, yep. and night unto night sheweth knowledge. This word is being pushed day into day, night into night. On the internet. You, you, like, like, like at the camp, you know, uh, you know, we, you know, we, we chill and break bread. Mm-hmm. And then on top of that, you got brothers, uh, you got brothers uh, 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 over there in Hawaii uh, 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 doing camp at night. night. You know, so well, it's our night, but their day. The water, our night, their day, the water. Yeah. You know, so, so like, there's no excuse for you not to have heard this word. Right? And that's another thing too, if you notice. Uh, which is all the spirit. It's not we're not glorifying us, but if you notice, like like during the week, we still do lessons. Yeah. You know what I mean? But like if you look at like the IUIC, ICBK, they're not diligently Doing out less, yeah, yeah. or uh, at, at camp. Do they go out during the winter? Nah, we didn't go. Oh, yeah. man. But it says be in season, out of season. Yeah. So it kind of makes you like, oh, Peter said it. We rather obey God Brother, than yeah. men. But you're telling me I can't shalom a fellow Israelite. Or I can't go out in the winter, but I'm pressed in the spirit. I got to wait. See? Right. So it makes you, you know, that's not the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit says, who can but prophesize? Uh, Jeremiah said it was it was burned in me. Right. You know, but keep going. It says, there is no speech nor language where their voice is not heard. Right. You, like, you got bros that speak, you know, Portuguese. You got bros that, that speak sign language. You know what I mean? Spanish. Spanish. You have whole Spanish camps. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know? And that's another thing too, even though uh, uh, when you look at Great Millstone's fruit, they look like everybody on the board because Israel's everybody. Now, you know, you may have some that may look white, may look this, but not every brother's a dark Wesley Snipes brother. (laughs) But it makes sense why they are because back then the Pharisees were all Southern Kingdom. So, you know what I mean? When you look at it, it's like, I can see why all y'all Judah. Yep. You know what I mean? Cause, or, cause, you know what I mean? Because on this, at that time, remember the Northern Brothers was already over here. Yeah, yep, it was. They were already. We were already. You know. You you a Northern King? Uh, I, I identify as Gad. Gad, okay, okay. Yeah, I identify as Gad. When I first came out, I said I was Judah. Yeah. But you know, you got to be spiritual. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So I, I believe I'm I'm Gad. So we'll see when I get in the kingdom. All right. You know. No, they Judah, Benjamin, right? Uh, Levi. Levi. Okay. Benjamin. What do what do you what do you? What do you I'm Judah. Oh, okay, yeah. right. Hey, tell them why I'm your how it up. There you go, brother. Yeah, yeah. Beautiful. And it says, um, uh, right here, it says, uh, right, going back, nor knowledge where their voice not heard. You can have this video be in Korea and the subtitles will be Korean. Yeah, exactly. You know? Yeah. And it says, uh, 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 it says, their, uh, Psalms 19 and 4, their line, remember AOL? Uh, broadband internet, yeah, yeah, yeah. right? Their line is gone out through all the earth into yep. earth, into net earth terrain, yep. internet, yeah. the internet. Uh-huh. You see, that's how the what line. Scripture is that? This is Psalms 19. 19 okay. And we precept it with Romans. Uh, Romans 10. It's my bad. Romans 10 and verse 18. I wish I could check right there. Yeah, Romans 10 and 18 with Psalms 19. And you could just look up uh, GMS internet. You okay. know what I mean? Like right, the right. Lord, the the, the, the Yahweh Bush is Messiah just pours. Is open. It's open. Okay. You know. And then Yahweh said, "What the uh the um 
what did he say? Well, I got to be careful. He's like, uh, the kingdom is, is uh, the, uh, the kingdom is like the net, a uh, uh, cast to the sea. Yep. You know, it's that net, internet. Yep. You know, and, and then and, and through the internet, you know, uh, uh, this, bring gospel, the, this gospel is, is being pushed. Yep. You know, uh, uh, to be who? The elect. You know? Yeah, bring in both bad and good. good. Yep. When you put a video on the internet, you'll get a sincere brother. You'll get a scoffer. Hey, you got uh, uh, IUIC being outed for making female uh, uh, profiles. Yeah. They actually made profiles of sisters, yep. and it was a man behind it. It was a, it was oh, yeah, a, yeah, 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 yeah. That's terrible. You got actual high-ranking IUIC members that follow Elder Apostle Tahar's videos. He's under a different name, and he says he knows them what the mark is, but he said they're not ready for it. Yeah, I heard about that. I heard about that. Yeah. I mean, we'll find out in the kingdom, yep. you know. Yep. But uh, it says uh, Psalms 19 and 4. Their line has gone out through all the earth and their words to the end of the world and then has he set a tabernacle for the sun. See, so they, their words, can we get Matthew 24? I got it. You got it. You read it. This is Matthew 24 and 14. And this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached in all the world for a witness unto all nations and then shall the end come. Is there, is there an IUIC, GMS, or ICPK camp in Korea, but you had an elder who's now an elder of LA. He was stationed in South Korea, right? When he was in the military and got the word mm. through the internet. So he was in it across the world and yeah. heard it yeah. okay. so because yeah. the internet. Yeah. So that's why, you know, if we, we bringing this out because we're talking to an ex member, which we bring out for truth's sake, but it's like this proves we don't need a jet. Right. We don't need a jet. That takes away faith. Right. What are you talking about a jet? You know what I mean? We should be gathering together and are keeping our money straight, keeping our faith good, because we about hey, Esau's about to crash in. Yeah, yeah. About this shit's about to lock down. Yeah, about to go down. We might not have another Passover. They might not get another fashion show. Right. They might not be able to release another Royalty Kingdoms album. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Then to prove that on top of the, uh, how the score is being pushed, uh, you got Israelite like foreigners from, from like the uh the um uh, Philippines, Philippines, Korea, call upon the name of Yahweh Bashmal Shot, and then, uh, then through that they can be delivered. You know, got a quick preach. And that's another thing too. A lot of camps push, uh, just like like this woman right there. Oh, you white people going into slavery? You can't say that. Now we can say Edomites, yeah. but we got our people that look just like them. Oh, I see. Oh, I, yo, it was a lady. She was the secretary of my job. Her name was Melissa. Melissa. She looked straight like an Edomite. Her dad is Levi. Her mom is Spank. But if you see her, you would think she was a white Like Griffin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like Griffin. Hey, I, you know what, brother? Between me and you and the camera, now, like, they'll push also, you got to only be with our women. Our women are heathens. You have heathen women more ready in line to serve you than a black woman. Yep. I'd rather be with a, a white woman that's a Jake than a black woman that's a Jake. Jake. Because she she's kind of more humbler. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you can't even get with a black woman and try to teach the law to her. You know what I mean? I get, yeah. our, our people are heathens right now. Yeah, they, they minds are sealed with Through. a sealed, sealed with the iron. Yeah. The whole yeah. head's sick. sick. Yeah. The Lord gave her a fat ass. She don't know what to do with it. With it. Everybody can touch it, but you got to open the door, pay for a meal, and bow down just to get a whip. But every, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yep. So that... You know, it's, it's it's messed up out here for the Israelite man. Yeah. See, we're out here for the Israelite men. Now, we don't discredit our sisters, but hey, my uh, my flock is a pastor of men. That's right. It's the men. Who, who was the first Israelite? Oh, Jesus. Jacob. Oh, 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 no, nope. Jacob. 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 It's all good, brother. It's yeah, all good. Yeah, it's okay. Yeah, yeah. Jacob. Yeah. Jacob was uh, uh, Jacob and then Yasharala. Yeah. Did, and then when he had his 12 sons, which one of his wives was an Israelite? Not a narrow one. <laughs> so you sisters out there, be humble. Yeah. Be humble and, and, and be appreciative that an Israelite man wants to be with you as an Israelite woman. And not just because you're an Israelite woman. So don't let that shit go to your head. Because that's what Babylon has done. A lot of these sisters in the truth, they're coming on our common board talking about you need to be uh, more for the sisters. Who are the who are you even to tell us men what we have to do with this ministry? You know, and that see, that's the standard that the Lord is bringing out here. Well, you got a lot of pussy fight camps. Yeah, you got a lot of woman worshiping camps. 
you got a, uh, did you ever have to bow to the sisters? No. Nah. When you ever see it, like you got other brothers in bigger camps, yeah. like outside of Rochester, they'll turn to the sisters yep. and bow. Oh, no, nah, we didn't do that. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. What's up with that? Yeah. And another thing, we're in the flesh. Yeah. I don't want to see your woman. I don't want to see your woman. Exactly. It's not because I'm adulterer, but Satan might jump in my head and be like, look at her ass. Right, yep. Why do you want to put me through that? Why I got to be around a bunch of sisters and then they all got men? Yeah. Well, why I want to be around them? No, that's not right. You brothers got who bring up precepts? Uh, back in uh, uh, yeah, Isaiah 11 and verse 11. See, this is the reality of, of what we're involved in. You know, like we're talking to you as as men. You know what I mean? Like I feel like a lot of a lot of these Israelites, the, uh, they don't know how to speak to our people when they come up. Right. You know what I mean? Like you gotta you gotta not reason and if agree with them, but you gotta be able to have a one on one. Be real with them. You gotta be real. We're being real with you. Scriptures. You know, we're not just. Ah, we're being real with you. Right. Yeah. That's the spirit flowing, you know? Yeah. Being realist. I it's like that's like it. Isaiah 11 and verse 11, and it says, And it shall come to pass in that day. I'm going to start at verse 10, matter of fact. Isaiah 11 and verse 10, and, and, uh, and in that day, there shall be a root of Jesse, who shall stand for an ensign of the people, to it shall, uh, to it shall the Gentiles seek. Us, now us. the Gentiles talk about who? There's like farmers. Yep. There's like not actual either. Yep. And it says because uh, it said that um, I will provoke you to jealousy. Yeah, yeah. Uh, in Romans, yep. I will provoke you to wrath by jealousy. You know, okay. Yeah. What, okay. According to that right there, the scriptures what it was saying about um, many should come that will eat with Jacob, with Jacob and Isaac, but the children of light will cast out all the darkness. What's the what's the understanding of that? Cause some people say. That the other nations is going to be in the kingdom more than the Israelite is going to be. You know, you know what I'm I heard that. Break. I know what you're talking about. That's talking about the Israelite form. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah, I kind of figured it out. I kind of went back to the fold. Now, yeah. The okay. nations, they don't have no no place in our, in our temple. Okay, okay. You know, they, they belong on the outside. outside. Yeah, they're right. profane yeah. like America. Okay. America's profane. Right. Just the sort of heathens. But in Isaiah 2, they are going to come to us. Yeah. Just like how we got to go to the DCS building to get welfare. Yeah. We got to go to RG&E to get electricity. We got to go to Wegmans and Price Right to get their food. Yeah. They're going to have to come to us. Yeah. They're going to have to use our laws. They're going to have to use our money. They're going to have to abide by our ways. Yeah. Or they ain't going to get no rain. Ain't going to be no crops. They're going to get judged. Oh, so it's just like they don't play their bill. We're going to cut, they gonna cut, cut their elements. lights off. We're going to cut the elements off on them. Yeah. 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 That's probably. Actually, that's I could get it. Yeah. Yeah. I'll get it. In Zechariah, I'll get it. I'll get it. Okay. But you got it while I'm looking for it, brother. I'm going to finish it off. Back in Isaiah 11, verse 11, and it says, And it shall come to pass in that day that the Lord shall set his hand again the second time to recover the remnant of his people, who shall be left from Assyria and from Egypt and from Pathros and from Cush and from uh, from Elam and from Shinar and from Hamad and from the islands of the sea. And that's talking about the, uh, these Israelite foreigners because he, because this word uh, uh, this word is being pushed across the four winds of the earth, you know, uh, to be a witness unto all nations yeah. and, 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 and uh, pertain to the curses. But, uh, the, the, the uh, nation of Israel has been what scattered. Yeah. So Israel is everywhere, you know. So that's why, uh, so that's why people that that's Egypt, the Israelites, yeah. you know, uh, 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 Asia, East India, yeah. they're gonna be delivered. Yeah. You know. You got some? Do you have some around? Yeah, come. All right. All right. So, if not, I got one. Okay. This is Zach for the brother about that. Like he said, we are gonna cut the elements off. Yep. Uh, and we are gonna send other nations on them. We're going to put taskmasters, overseers on them. Yeah. We're going to send lions, tigers, and bears on them. Oh, wow. You know? But you got to understand, we're going to do it righteously. We're not just going to see an eating my baby crawling. Well, maybe. But we're not just going <laughs> to. No, and I mean, what I'm saying yeah, yeah, yeah. is because we they got to build. Yeah. They got to build. We're going to feed them just what they need. We got a kingdom that's got to get built back. Yeah. So what would I do, uh, like Esau? Go pick that kind, and I'm whipping you as you're picking right. it. I can't pick it. Yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna make sure they do their job. Uh -huh. You know. But if they, they don't fulfill the quota, well then you know I gotta you gotta, you gotta be dead ass. Shut off. Right. Right. Yeah. right. Well they do that now. Nah, yeah. You're like, why the my lights like, ain't working? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm sorry. You know. Yeah, yeah. But this is Zechariah, 14, and um, let's see. We'll start at 17, and it says, um, and it shall be that whoso will not come up of all the families of the earth unto Jerusalem to worship the king, the Lord of hosts, 
even upon them shall be no rain. Yep. So if you don't come up and do what is according, then, then you're going to go through famines, troubles, tribulations, poverty. There are famines. That's me sometimes. I got $2 in my name daily. I want God to turn my life around. It's coming. Don't worry. It's coming. When it's coming. Six, it happens. It's, it's coming. Right. And, it's, and it says uh, 18, and it says... Jake's oh, that's that one Jake from last time. That's a character. Yeah. You deal with that out here. But he needs healing. It says, um, uh, I will smite them with madness. Right. Yep. Just, right. Jake just mad right now, you know? He wasn't talking to us. Yeah. But uh, but he did c confess, yeah. you know? And he's in poverty, you know, which will lead to famine. But it says, um, and if the family of Egypt go not up and come not that have no rain, there shall be the plague wherewith the Lord will smite the heathen that come not up to keep the feast of tabernacle. Right. So if you ain't living by the laws, you're gonna be judged. You right now. If you wanna drive down this street drunk, pass a red light, cut off, smack a bitch, turn right on the left, you gotta get penalties. Right. But 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 yeah. see, his are unrighteous. Even though you shouldn't be driving and doing all that, but we're gonna be making you live by righteous laws. Because a pedophile can stop at every red light and turn on every left and not get in trouble. But you're going to get judged for being wicked and not living by the laws. Mm -hmm. You see? Because yeah. Esau, Esau caught lives by the laws, but he's drinking baby blood and, yeah. you know what I mean? Doing wild Doing stuff. Testable yeah. things yeah. behind the scenes, man. And it says, uh, this shall be the punishment of Egypt and the punishment of all nations. All nations. That come not up to keep the feast of tabernacles. No, and, that see? and that proves that in, 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 uh, in our kingdom, nations is going to be under us. Just like right now, we know, uh, the, the whole nation of Israel is under who? Every nation under nation the earth. earth. Starting mm -hmm. off with Esau, Edom, the crafty council, man. And then you know? one could say, well, it just says feast of tabernacles. But if it's telling you one law, that's all the laws. Because right. what's it saying in our law? If you commit uh, one transgression, right. it's, it's all of them. Yeah. So that's showing you, hey, you're going to have to do the feast. You're going to have to reverence this. You're going to have to have the Passover, the Sabbath. They're going to have to follow the dietary law. And that's when we're going to be able to swim in the ocean. All the oysters going to be there. You see, then we can talk about the laws. See, that's when, when we're sitting at a round table as kings. That's when we can go in about the laws. Right now, we got to go in about prophecy. You know? Prophecy is the main thing that we have to focus on. So, yeah, I agree. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, yeah, but I when we're ruling, like um, like a woman, she don't have a home, but she's imagining the drapes. I want to have the house. Then we can talk about the right, drapes. Right. You see what I'm yeah. saying? Let's Thank talk you. about the prophecy to get there. Yeah, I do agree because, you know, when I was watching your shit, they always just focus on marriage, trying to have a family, get our own property. Get, they were just focused on I said, why you don't go into prophecies anymore? Hear people what's going on out here. But they say the prophets are back. Back, yeah. What are you prophesizing about? Marriage. Marriage. He had a really good marriage. He yeah. had both parents. <laughs> nah, man. Hey, well, that's good, brother. Yeah. That's good that you had that spirit. And that, that's from the Lord. Uh, John 3. Let's get John 3. Okay, yep. This is Revelation 2 and verse uh, 26. And he that overcometh and keeping my works unto, unto the end, to him will I give power over the nations. Right. Power over the nations, all right? And that's physical. That, that's not symbolic. Right. That, yeah. That's literal, yeah. all right? So, and that power, that power is, is, uh, is going to be uh, bestowed upon uh, 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 Yahweh Shai and then the elect, you know? It yeah, started right. with the 12, right? The line, you know, because this is a patriarch, yeah. you know, a monarchy. You know, we're going to have a monarch in the kingdom, you know, our sons because of us. And their sons because of them, yeah. you know. And he shall rule over them with a rod of iron, as the vessels of a powder shall they be broken to shivers, even as I received of my father. Right, so and so they break any laws, and they don't want to worship us. It's like the uh, Sermon on the Mount, they're going to be judged. It's going to be famine in the land. It's going to be dearth. You know, no rain for the crops. You, you, you're going to be open season. You're going to be broken in pieces. Yeah. Because uh, when Esau, if he pulls you over, what's he do? Well, now it's the gun. But before when we were growing up, uh, it was the nightstick. Yep. So that was his scepter. Yep. You know, and then you see in like Bugs Bunny, boop, and then yep. that big ass knot. Yep. 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 You know, Rodney King. Yep. Yep. Look at Rodney video. So imagine now in righteousness. You see, in righteousness, we're going to be doing that by law. Right. You know, by law, we're going to be judging. And guess what? The, the, the heathens are going to rejoice. They're going to actually see, wow, it's, it's beneficial. They're actually going to be in the field 
as a future prophecy, they're going to be in the field and they're going to say, man, it's as if the Garden of Eden is back. Right That's what they're going to say. Wow. You know, we got it. We'll get it. Right. Whatever you get, I'll get it for him. Yep. You got to get, you said John 3, right? Here. Well, I was going to read that for him. Oh, okay, okay, okay. like, But this is John 3, 27. John answered and said, a man can receive nothing except it be given him from heaven. So the thoughts that you've been saying, the things you've been thinking, you know, now, of course, you have to have, uh, like you said earlier, um, uh, uh, not dis well, discretion. You have to have spiritual discernment. Sorry. So you also got to be aware with your thoughts that it's not Satan, but you have discernment that's been given from above. To show you who you were with wasn't right. right. Now you're here now, so that'll keep you humble. Right. Say, please keep me in that mindset and not Deuteronomy 28 and 28. Because yeah. you got some members of Israel that are in camps that are smitten well, no, with madness. Not, yeah, not They're thing. crazy. Yeah. Like, you're crazy. You know what I mean? So I just wanted to share that with you. You know, because we always got to reverence you how about so, shot. Yeah. So we can stay humble and stay fearful and tell them, please, we'll keep supping with me. You know, keep me... Yeah. Keep me near you. Yeah, that's what I, I was saying that praying that this morning. Said, See? Keep me on, keep me. Beautiful. Yeah. Right. Brothers got some? Yeah. This is Isaiah 2 and oh, 1. Yeah. The word that Isaiah, the son of Amos, saw concerning Judah and Jerusalem. And it shall come to pass in the last days that the mountain of Yahweh Shemiel Shai's house shall be established. In the top of the mountains. Yeah, that Mount Talk Mount Hula, the, uh, the, uh, the governing body of the nation of Israel. It says, and it shall be exalted above the hills, yep. and all nations shall flow unto it. Right, all nations, all nations of the earth is going to flow unto us like a river, right. you know? And, and, uh, and uh, for what? For, for, for our, our wisdom, our laws, our commandments. Just like right now, how, 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 everybody in uh, this stone world, they serve Esau. You know, they serve his laws and land, so on and so forth. And everybody want to come here. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, that's why you got all those cargo ships uh, out in uh, uh, the West Coast and East Coast yep. uh, for four weeks. Yeah. And they're coming from everywhere. Yo, you kind of, you kind of like you could be held to our son a little. Nah, <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm, I'm gay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, they got them up right now. Yeah. You know what I mean? For four weeks. So because they're all flowing where to here. Yeah. You see? So, pot. so just like the brother saying, so that's gonna, because the world's upside down right now. Mm -hmm. They're serving the base man. Then when it flips side up, they're gonna serve the top, top man. That's right. You know. Verse three. And many people shall go and say, Come ye, and let us go up to the mountain of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, to the house of the power of Jacob. Yep. And he will teach us of his ways, and we will walk in his paths. That's a cut. Man. With all these Christians, I, well, we, now talk about the law. You know, Christians, the law is done away with. That's going to be a cut when, you, when you're in the kingdom. Because these people are going to know. Edomite ain't going to wake up and just think, Oh, I'm an Edomite. They're right. going to know what happened. They're going to know their downfall. And guess what? There's people walking the earth right now that will be first generation in our kingdom. That's right. Because not everyone's going to be killed on earth. Yeah. You got to think of the, the villages throughout Europe, Scandinavia. Amsterdam. 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 Right. You got people. We got future wives right now that are walking the earth or being born right now. Mm. There's going to be people on the earth that will die off in our kingdom mm -hmm. that are here right now. Mm. It's re realistically. Because you got to think, America's going to be destroyed, not the world. The world. Yeah. You know, the world of Edom, the age of Edom, the god of this age. Yep. But what about the people where nukes ain't going to hit? Yeah. They're going to be around, wow. and yep. they're going to be the first crops. Outside of Esau, the first crops of slave, yep. they're going to be their progenitors for Ham. Yep. You know what I mean? So when we be in the chariots, that's when we're going to be in the chariots waiting for everything to slow down. Well, well, what you'll have, it, yes... Yes, because we're going to be taken out of the indignation, yep. but we're going to see the indignation of America, but we're going to come down in another land. Yeah, okay. You know, because remember, we still got to go to the wilderness. Okay. You know, yeah, no, we and we're not going to kill our kids oh, yeah, in the wilderness. Because, yo, because that's what we just talked <laughs> oh, When we get in the wilderness, we're going to put a lot of y'all to death because y'all going to be. Like, They're going to purge out the rebels. Rebels. Now, where does the rebels start? With the circumcision. Mm. So I don't know if Nate's in America anymore, but you got a lot of Israelites that are leaving America. Yeah. Mm. But you could be leaving, so you could be picked up to be brought to the wilderness. Yep. Mm. And that's scary. Imagine saying Christ in front of you, I was shy. Whoa! So, so when we get pulled up, we get their mortal bodies. The, the ones that didn't get taken up in the chariots, at the um, loops they hit. Is they gonna get immortal bodies or? As far as who? Like the, the, the like the, 
Israelite form. Like what, what you're going to have is, see, you know what I'll say? We know in part, so we prophesize in part. So like us, we're being uh, baptized now. Mm -hmm. So like uh, through the Lord, you know, I'm not who I was two years ago. Yeah. So there's going to be a process of change for the nation of Israel. Mm -hmm. We're just going to have to wait and see how it plays out. Plays, okay, okay. You know what I mean? Hey, the Lord could bring up all of the believers. Mm -hmm. and, you know, remember in a twinkle of an eye. Yeah. Remember, Yahweh Shai stood there and went just like this. Boom. And his, his arm came back. So you could... Change like that. He turned a man leprous clean. clean. So you could just be boom and it happens. Mm. He told the man, he said, your son's already healed. So yeah. it could play out like that too. Okay. You know what I mean? We're going to see. But we will all be changed. changed. Israel, you're not going to see, you know, Pookie walking down all jacked up. Right here. Our women are going to look better. Our men going to look better. Our kids going to look better. We going to be better. You know? So that wilderness. So, okay. I already know about the first time, the rebels. So that's like these camps or? Uh, well, that's going to be ultimately for the Lord, but you will have purging happen to our people. Because okay. remember it says, uh, Luke 19 and 27, they will not serve me, yep. bring them hither and slay them before me. So when we come down, Lords, will we be those men? Yeah. Which, you know, you got to have faith you are yeah. at the end of the day. Yeah. Lords, will we be those men? If they're not with the program, then they get put to death. Yeah, exactly. But if they do get put with, with the program, they got to be the multitude. They got to be the mixed multitude. You know, when we touch down in Korea, you know what I mean? We touch down in deep woods in Germany. Because there ain't going to be nobody on earth doing their own thing. So, oh, now I get the wilderness. See, I thought we was going to be in one spot, one area. It's going to be, we're going to be really sifting out things going on. We're, we're going to be correcting, but there is a prophecy where we'll specifically purge out the rebels in the wilderness. wilderness okay. And it could be South America. Okay. Like the Brother's Dream. Yeah. You could have wicked Israelites be actually beamed up and brought to the wilderness mm. to be judged. Okay. You actually could have that instead of getting a nuke. You, you know what I mean? Ooh, so yeah. we're going to find out. Okay. We'll find out. But there will be a prophecy fulfilled that we will be brought to the wilderness again. Yeah. Okay. You know? But the process of who and who, such and such, we're going to find out. But, you, but just know they will be rebels. Damn, right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they yeah. will be rebels. Well, right. And remember, rebellion is as a sin of witchcraft. witchcraft. Yeah. You know, so we'll be, we're going to be ridding out the witches of Israel. Okay. You know, there's a lot of them. You got it, bro. This is Isaiah 2 and verse 4. And he shall judge among the nations and shall rebuke many people. And they shall beat their swords into plowshares and their spears into pruning hooks. And, it was, and, and that he's talking about who? Yahweh shine the elect. You know, or it's like Yahweh shine the 12 and the elect. Okay, because uh, they're going to be uh, the, uh, that ruling body of the nation of Israel. You know, and then on top of that, uh, it's like it. They're gonna be uh, judging these nations if they don't get right. But you know, but if, you know, if they do get right, the Lord's gonna bless them through us. You know. And we're gonna kill those that got the mark. Yeah. Because not everyone yeah. that's got the mark, you yeah. know, what I mean, might get hit with a nuke over in the other land. That's very true. We might take them and throw them, throw them in the lake mm -hmm. over here. You know, with that super, that super yeah. power. Wow. We gonna see. You know, might actually right. take them. You know, what I mean, you you like watch, you got Jake. Watching uh, uh, Kobe shoot a half court three, we might shoot a heathen. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. Like, you know, I'm just, if you will, if you will, if you will, you know, because remember, in Second Ezra 13, it says some were bound and some were happy. So when the chariots come, some are gonna get bound and taken. They show you that in certain movies where actually you so-called UFOs take people, and then like the Battle of Los Angeles, and they got.